we fly to, not directly to Africa, we fly to Krita, Krita, yeah, Krita. And Krita, we wait some days for a plane to Africa. And because no plane was here, there was a, a transport crew, uh, squadron coming, loaded with gasoline. Uh, and Sigi said, oh, let's take this. Oh, we said, on the ga- sitting on the gasoline bottles. But the, <laughs> he was a very proud man. So we sit down and says, and we fly to Africa. And they arrived there, arrived Terna, on the north coast of Africa. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And there we had a lot to do as it was because it is a war on. We fly very often to Tobruk, we attack Tobruk very often. And all the Mechilis are all the places where we are. Angriff auf englische Lastkraftwagen. Der Hafen von Tobruk. Englisches Flakfeuer. Unter uns ein Frachter. Ein Benzinlager ist in Brand geworfen. And one day uh, we got the order to attack Pir El Hachem. Pir El Hachem that was a fortress south of Tobruk and Rommel was going on to the west. And uh, and Pir El Hachem, he overtake Pir El Hachem, he let it stay and went on in the north and in the south of the Via Balba was Pir El Hachem. So he made a, a, a circle around this Pir El Hachem and wanted to take it. But they have been very hard fighters. The Free French, I think, or something like this has been there. <coughs> And so we had always to attack this sometimes. And on one day, it was at about 12 o'clock or one o'clock in the midday, uh, I, we come here, we go down over Pierre Hachem attack and dropped our bombs and going home, uh, I miss a lot of words, special words, abfangen, the plane. Uh, 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 I heard bum, bum, bum. in the same moment it started to to explode uh, the gasoline because we have already I think 200 liters or more on it and no not only this yeah uh, and I was there was, I was nothing to do I even could not touch how you call this in an airplane? Yeah, yeah, I, could, yeah, I, could, I could not touch it. So I go in the corner, give my hand up, and that was the reason that I have been burned on the most, most here, and jumped out of the plane and come down. And coming down, uh, jumping out and sitting in the, yeah, yeah sitting in the, in the, in, in the parachute, I was very afraid because I saw in the parachute big holes already in, by the, made by the fire. Yeah. So I was afraid the uh, parachute will go together and be zzzzt and I will fall down. So I, I worked hard to keep it all right. And, and on the ground I was happy. I got not straight down. I it make a little jump, jump, so, and I fall in the desert in the sand of the desert. And then I was laying, I had heavy, heavily, heavy burns in the face and so, and one leg also, trouser was away. Uh, 
And then arrived in the same moment, arrived a, a armed car, an English armed car, and they come out and no, they didn't come out. They stopped <clears throat> 10 meters before me and the soldier, <coughs> and the soldier cried out. I thought, hey, hands up, German, hands up. And I educated the German, never give up. <laughs> I didn't do it. I was standing and looked bad. So he again, he turned his machine gun in my direction. Oh, I said, no, <laughs> it's critically no. <laughs> so I have to do it, give up the hands and said, yes. So hands, made hands up and they come to me, take, I have a pistol around, they take it away and say, my, my parachute, say put on the, on the, on, on the armed car, and on this they lay me in. There was an army station there, an ambulance station. They brought me in the ambulance station there, and there was already a, a line waiting to come in this, to the doctor. And I was nearly on the end of the line. And this, I remember, was very, I wonder myself that they are so, so fair, and so to take me out and bring me in, in in the beginning, and coming in, they gave me more film, ha, ah, and so ba so pains were gone, and then we they wrapped me in, they wrapped me so much in that I must have looked terrible, <laughs> because a priest, no uh, uh, idea what kind of religion does, come <laughs> and come and wanted to give me the last oil, as we call it, you know, Catholic. I said yes. <laughs> He gave me the last oil, so you get it usually when you die here. Yeah. And then, yeah, yeah, I have been lucky always, I have been lucky always.